Hello everybody, welcome back to another video and I have a very special mock. This is Utapau in the First Order era and there's a lot of really cool details I've put into this mock. Definitely one of my favorites and I've had this mock for about two months now. I just finally got around to making a video on it. Basically, the resistance forces are trying to, you know, get inside this base which is pretty much behind this mountain here. I just have the front of the base and uh, there's this giant pipe that's going out and then there's a lot of greebling which I integrated and uh, I really love uh, just the aesthetic that this mock uh, brings. Down here we have a small um, little pool of like water you know there's like some some chemicals or something leaking out into the water um, and there's studs representing kind of bubbles. We have a dead resistance trooper over here as you can see he got brutally wounded um, and then we have a first order gunner over here trying to shoot this guy or I believe it's a guy yeah it's a guy. Uh, I can't tell um and then he's trying to get up here and you know trying to climb these stairs and uh, this guy got his brains blow up, literally um by this first order trooper this is also based off of iadu especially the ladder and basically the ladder is made up of these grill tiles which go all the way up here and as you can see you can also look down here which i really like this as well sorry for the dust it's a difficult mock to dust and um yeah, we have a first order jet trooper up here um, and he's just kind of shooting at the resistance troopers that are trying to approach up this resistance trooper up here which is being shot at by um, this uh, first order trooper over here which fortunately he missed and he was like on, on, on the other side of it. I don't know what the stormtrooper was thinking of um, and then of course he has this really cool um, blaster with a rubber band on it probably representing some form of a grip and as you can see there's a lot of really cool detailing pieces uh greebling pieces that are on the mock and as we go down there's another resistance trooper which is probably trying to get a good shot on this uh trooper over here that shot this guy uh and then of course this guy probably got shot off by this guy and he just he's just falling because you know the there's not really much of a barrier for from keeping you from falling off so of course you got to be kind of um, aware of your surroundings and then we have their officer like leader i guess over here which is you know trying to take out this trooper as well so he's got like two people on him uh and then of course we have this giant turret over here which i really love um definitely one of my favorite parts of this mock here i really love this turret and then we have a first order a captain that's kind of running over to it i really love his gun um and then we have a I think this is a thick honor actually so this guy would be going over this guy's probably just going over to shoot off the resistance people here um and then once again i just really love when you look down here you can see everything going on i really love the grill tiles i utilized on this mock and um as you could and you can kind of see i have a bit of a black border here and it just goes on both on um, each side of it uh, not in the front or on the back. Technically, it would be going here, but this ever, I decided to have everything kind of spill over, which I like a lot more. Um, and I really do love this um, base I have, especially the snot right here. I really love that. And of course, the entire build uh, is pretty much built on a snot um, backing. And um, I really love the detail up here. There's like a small explosion or something. Um, and I just used a bunch of cheese slopes, dark in uh, dark orange, uh, dark tan, and some medium nougat. And then this is what the back looks like. You could just see what I did. Basically, this is how I got it to connect. And um, and then of course I have everything kind of reconnected over with this giant pipe. So um, fortunately everything is a legal connection um, and I just absolutely love it. Also, there's two crates over here, which I really love this front one. The back one's just kind of eh, but it's still a crate at the end of the day. Um, and then also I have this uh, translucent red uh, grill plate, which I also put here as well. So. I really love this mock, definitely one of my favorite mocks. I'm gonna keep it all here for a while, unless I decide to destroy it for Wakanda, which I am officially now doing. I'm building Wakanda once I finish Navarro, which I said I wanted to get Navarro done this weekend, but unfortunately it's probably not gonna turn out to be that way, um, hopefully next weekend. But um, I'm very excited for the future of my projects, especially once I'm done with Navarro. And um, thank you all for watching. This was definitely one of my favorite mocks and um, I'm happy I was able to share it with you guys and have a fantastic day. Goodbye.